title of this legislation is Improving Public Safety and Criminal Justice for Native Americans and Addressing the Crisis of Missing or Murdered Indigenous People. I'm proud to sign it. Long overdue. Thank you all so very much. We're going to make some substantial change in the Indian country. It's going to continue. Thank you all. When COVID-19 struck, in India hit, it hit Indian country with devastating consequences. Native Americans contracted the virus at over three times the rate of white Americans, nearly twice the rate of lives lost. Twice as many died as a percentage. The tribal nations stepped up, and today, the Native Americans have gone from being a population most harmed by COVID to one of the populations most vaccinated against COVID. That success has a lot to do with tribal leadership, but it also has to do with the American Rescue Plan, which included over $31 billion, $31 billion for tribal nations, the most significant investment in the history of Indian country, long overdue. Now we're taking the next step. Today I'm signing, and I'll certainly sign, a bipartisan infrastructure deal. Everyone knows we're long overdue to make major investments in infrastructure, but nobody knows that better than Indian country. Tribal lands have been chronically underfunded for generations. And so I'm very proud to say that when I signed the bill outside in the South Lawn shortly, the single largest investment in tribal infrastructure ever is going to occur, more than $13 billion direct investments to Indian country and tens of billions more in grants and future funding opportunities.